Here's another example. In 1995, at the World Snail Racing Championships in Longen, England, the winning snail, snail moved 13 inches in two minutes. And I'm not making this up. These people actually do this. The World Snail Racing Championships. They're not racing cars or jet planes or something. They're racing snails. And this snail went 13 inches in two minutes. And that was a world record. This is actually in the Guinness Book of World Records for snail racing. The fastest snail in the world. We want to convert this speed into miles per hour. So here we go. How fast was this snail going? Well, the average speed is distance over time. And the distance is 13 inches. And we divide that by the time, and the time is 2 minutes. So this is pretty easy. 13 divided by 2 is 6.5. So he was going 6.5 inches per minute. And that should make a lot of sense. If he goes 13 inches in 2 minutes, then he goes half that distance per minute. So that's the speed. We want to convert that to miles per hour. So I start by writing down 6.5 inches per minute. The thing that I want to convert to something else, I always start by writing that down. And then I multiply by a fraction equal to 1. In this case, I need to get rid of the inches, so I'm going to put inches down here on the opposite side of the fraction bar so that those will cancel. I need to get rid of inches and get miles. Well, I don't know how many inches there are in a mile, so here's what I'm going to do. Instead of putting inches there, I'm going to put feet because I know that one foot is equal to 12 inches. And this way, the inches here cancel out the inches there. And then, then I'm going to multiply by 1 again. And now I'm going to get rid of the feet and get miles. And this way you can see that the feet up top and down on the bottom are going to cancel out. And I know that 1 mile is 5,280 feet. And now these will cancel out. Now look what's left. Miles up top and minutes on the bottom. That's miles per minute. What I need is miles per hour. That's what I was told to do, convert this to miles per hour. So I need to get rid of the minutes and get hours. And the minutes is down here on the bottom. So to get rid of the minutes, I need to put minutes up top. And I need to get hours down on the bottom. So I just need to convert between minutes and hours. And I know that one hour is 60 minutes. And now this minute way over here and the minute way up there, those can cancel out. Even though one's way over on the left and the other one's way over on the right, that doesn't matter. One is on the top and the other is on the bottom. And everything here is multiplied together, so these are all factors. These can cancel out algebraically. They can and they do. And look what's left. Miles in the numerator and hours in the denominator. Miles per hour, which is exactly what we wanted. And then we just do the math to get our answer. And the answer is going to be this. 6.5 div divided by 12 and divided by 5,280 times 60. And when I do that, I, and I do that on the calculator, I end up with 0 .0062 miles per hour. World record pace there for a snail.